Hey. Hey. How are you finding it out there today? <sighs> Tough. We're overheating the tires a little through the S's. Yeah, happens. Do you mind if I join you for a moment? Please. They want us to push for fourth. You think Williams are catchable? Maybe. Butler's having a good season. He claims he has been approached by Ferrari. I heard. He is the more experienced driver. I think the seat goes to him. You said it had always been your dream to drive for them. Is that true? Yeah. It is. Okay, I'm going to give you space out there. I'm sorry I didn't do that before. I'm sorry too. I want us to push for four. I want us to beat Butler. And I want that seat to go to you. Thanks, Casper. I don't know how we make that happen, but thanks. Well, we work together, help each other out. That's all we can do. Then let's do that. Yeah. Uh, we've adjusted the camber. Seems to help manage the tire temperatures a bit better. Yeah? I'll get them to share my setup data with you. Just see how it feels out there. Thank you, Casper. Truce. Truce. Aiden, Casper, hey, have you got a moment? Yeah, of course. That camber adjustment really helped. I guess I just wanted to thank you. Not a problem. Those tires in a better range now? Much more manageable. Thanks. Well, those milliseconds all add up. Brian says we can catch Williams. <laughs> Brian says a lot of things. Just focus on the next race. Thanks, Casper. I'll see you trackside. Seeing both Butler and Russell's lap times increasing. Uh, I still have time to catch them. Roger, we're on fresher tyres than they are. Push, push. Let's put the pressure on. Yeah, come here. Russell should be close now. Let's push. Gap to teammate ahead is 26.5 seconds.
You should be seeing Butler soon. Let's keep it clean, please, Cass. is 2.6 seconds. Pick up rubber and bring it home. Red Bull pulling out all the stops today. What a great win. Haas continue to put the pressure on Williams. That gap might still be a little too big to close, but for Haas, it's very much game on. Yeah, when I think back even just a couple of months, Crofty, I didn't have Haas pegged to be competing with Williams. Both Jackson and Ackerman performing at their absolute best out there today. Well, they certainly were, and no sign of any disputes on or off track between the pair of them. Might they have put their differences behind them? The drivers are en route to the podium as we speak. What a fantastic win for the Red Bull team. They performed exceptionally today, keeping us firmly on the edge of our seats throughout the entirety of the race. Congratulations to every one of the team. Good day today. Let's have your take on it. Solid performance out there today, Casper. You must be pleased. Yeah, the competition feels like it's fiercer than ever this season. And the team is working really hard to keep up, so we're grateful for every point we earn. Those points bring you a little bit closer to Williams. Is that something you're particularly focused on during the race? Absolutely. We're into the business end of the season now, and we want to climb as many places as we can. Right now, that means catching Williams. So, any time we can put the pressure on a little, that's good for us. We asked Devin Butler a similar question. He said, and I quote, Haas are a bit of a shambles. I don't think they're catching us anytime soon. What's your response to that? Sounds to me like uh, the words of a man running scared. Thank you for your time. Zoe. Daddy. Hey, Lils. Mommy says you're in America where the cowboys live. Yeah, Daddy's in America. Are you racing with cowboys, Daddy? <laughs> One or two. Hey, who's your favorite racing driver, Lils? You are. Just checking. Love you. Love you, Daddy. Hey, can I speak to Mum?
Hello? Apparently she enjoys hanging up on you these days. <laughs> so it seems. All set? Yeah, all set. The odds are shortening on the fourth place finish for Haas. It's a shame. I enjoyed being the underdog. You've still got to beat Butler. We've still got to beat Williams, you mean? That too, I guess. Right, you go and prepare. See ya. Bye. Fellas! Sell out crowd this ain't. Casper, I haven't seen you since you announced your retirement. No. Well, fair play to you, mate. Takes a brave man to admit he can't compete anymore. <laughs> I didn't mean it like that. I, I'm, I'm just saying, you're a brave man. I'm paying you a compliment. Now you're saying I can't compete? Nah, I didn't mean it like that. I just meant some have said that, uh... Well, you're past your prime, that's all. That won't work anymore, Devon. I'm sorry, <laughs> what won't work? We know what you've been saying about us. Oh, I genuinely don't know what you're talking about. You know, I used to think you were just a gossip, Devon. Now I know you're a liar. <laughs> oh, come on! You guys, you guys used to be so much more fun. Used to get into fights, take each other out of races. We all enjoyed that. I mean, you know, it was very entertaining. Now you just mope around bickering over who said what. It's a bit petty, to be honest, guys. Seriously, you're supposed to be role models. Yeah, I won't argue with you, Devon. I won't win. Yeah, you do seem to struggle a bit with winning, to be fair. Yeah. And maybe you are right. Maybe I am past it. But he's not. And he's the better driver. <laughs> what, the rookie? He's only just got here. You do know the Ferrari seat's fine. The contract's as good as signed. There's just one problem with that, Demon. Huh? Enlighten me. I don't believe a word you say anymore. Tell him, mate. Uh, mate? I don't know who this is going to. Let's keep this up. Here's the butler ahead. Butler? You're closing on it. No theatrics, please, Casper. Yeah, understood. Russell is ahead of you. Gap to car in front is 19.2 seconds. They're on fresh softs. Devon sat in P8.
That's the end of the race. We'll see you in Park Fermi. Well, this season promises to end in quite the dramatic fashion. The tussle for the top continues, but in the midfield, Haas very much closing the gap on Williams. Both teams have had a terrific season. Butler and Jackson rumoured to be in the running for that open Ferrari seat too. I can't wait to see how it all plays out. If you're anything like us, you won't want the season to end, but end it must. From here on in, every second of every lap counts. What a riveting season it's been. After an excellent performance at the Grand Prix, I'm sure there'll be plenty of celebrations tonight amongst the Mercedes team, and they certainly deserve it. That was an exciting race from our perspective. Let's have yours. Yet another victory over rivals Williams today, Casper, and more speculation over whether or not you can steal that fourth place. What do you have to say about that? Well, yes, and rightfully so, in my opinion. We've had our eye on fourth place for a while now, even when others have written us off. We're working tirelessly to make every second of every race count, and it's right that that's reflected in the standings. We know what we're capable of, and we know we can do it. Your retirement grows ever closer, of course. Is that something you think about? Yes, of course. It's easy to take a race for granted when it's all you ever do. But when you only have a certain number of races left, each one takes on a greater importance somehow. I think my retirement has allowed me to enjoy my racing a little bit more, and I'm grateful for that. Are you looking forward to your retirement? How will you spend it? I actually haven't thought about it much. You know, my wife, she tells me I'll miss all of this when it's gone, and I keep brushing her off. I say, yeah, yeah, but I think you know, I think she's probably right. Appreciate your time. Aiden. Casper, hey, we're closing in on Williams. Yeah, good race out there. I think we can do it, Casper. I think it's on. You know it's not going to be easy, right? Well, the fights that can't be won are the fights you fight the hardest. <laughs> that doesn't make any sense. Of course it does. Anyway, I'll leave you to it. Just wanted to say congrats. Yeah, you too. See ya. Bye. Brian. Casper, debrief has been put back 10 minutes, so you've got a little more time. Okay, thanks. Great race out there today. Who'd have thought we'd been pushing for fourth just a few months ago? Yeah, well, you know what they say. The fights that can't be won are the fights you fight the hardest. Whoa, brilliant. I'll have to remember that one. <laughs> That's inspiring is what that is. You keep fighting those fights, Casper. See you at the debrief. <laughs> yeah. Bye, Brian.